Oh, we've got a bathroom door that's about to fall over. It looks like the screws here pulled out of the casing. I'm gonna show you how easy it is to fix that. Hey, what's up YouTube, down the fix it man. Got another quick video here for you. Got a bathroom door that has pulled itself off of the hinge or pulled the hinge off of the door casing rather and the screws have pulled out and you can see that these holes are completely stripped out. This is just an MDF casing. It's pretty weak and it doesn't hold very well. And these screws are also really short. There really wasn't much bite there holding that on. Now there's lots of ways that you can fix this. One way is just to get some toothpicks and put them in these holes and just snap them off or break them off flush with the base of the hole here and stuff a few in there until it feels snug and then these screws will probably bite down again. You can also get some wood glue and fill those holes the best you can and then tap in either a sliver of wood or you can even use a little golf tee. If you've got a little wood golf tee, pound it in there and then either cut it off or break it off and sand it flush and then you can put these screws back in and that will work too. Or another option and what I'm going to do today is just use longer screws. These happen to be inch and five eighths in length and the ones on here are only three quarters of an inch. I'm just gonna pull these ones out and replace them and see how well that holds. So I'm just gonna take out the old screws and then I'm gonna put in these here. These are inch and five eighths. As long as I can just hold the door up, I think we'll be able to get that lined up. Looks like they're biting in there just fine. Right now you can see that they're only going in as far as the old screw. So we're getting quite a bit of grab on these new screws here. Now we could probably throw a little bit of touch up paint on that hinge if we want that to match. But that is fixed. Let's just test the door real quick. Looks perfect. You know, the idea behind the longer screws is it will go deeper and grab onto the framing that's on the other side of that jam. You don't want to get too tight with that because you don't want to pull this out of alignment, but that's just a quick and easy way that you can fix a door hinge that has pulled the screws out and stripped it out. Uh, again, you can also fill those holes with golf tees, other wood scraps, or even toothpicks temporarily, but the longer screw seems to work pretty well and looks like it's going to hold nice and solid. So I'm going to call this one done. Looks like it's going to work just fine. Those longer screws are holding on great. And the door still closes exactly like it should. We're back in business. I hope you liked the video. Please give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you don't mind. That does help me out. Thanks so much for watching and good luck.